give you a little short video on how to rotate parts and nest parts and sheet cam. So uh, here's our first part here. Obviously it's <coughs> longer than the width of the part. So if you look down here in the bottom right hand corner of the screen, it has an A dimension. Uh, well, first of all, we have the, our nesting tool at the top selected here, nesting. Down here in this dimension on the bottom right hand corner of the screen right here, we can just type in, we can type in 90. 90 degrees so we turn it 90 degrees and then we can just move it over on our plate and uh, say we want to move this part up just click and drag uh, say if we wanted to do two of these parts right click you can do duplicate there's another one you can also right click and do an array and you can tell it how you can have it fit the material, or you can tell it how many columns or rows you want to do of that one part. And then here's the important part: part spacing. Um, put a half inch part in between, or half inch in between each part, and you should be good. You can get them a little closer if you want. Um, this works pretty well. You just rotate parts. You can move them around and do anything you want to with them with the nesting tool.